before I start this video, guys, I just want to tell you, Lispy Leaf commented on my video. This is insane. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to open his channel just to show you. That is insane. He's verified everything. Oh my gosh. Lispy Leaf commented on my video out of everyone's. That's in out of every single YouTuber that plays Save the World. If you guys don't know who List Relief is, he is a uh, super popular scammer get scam YouTuber, and you should go check him out. His channel's gonna be in the description below. Uh, first thing, bro, that is insane. What do you mean? That is. What do you mean? What do you mean? All right, guys. Anyways, so enough of that. I'm gonna be getting right into the video, and yeah. So just hopefully you guys enjoy this video. Yo, what is up, guys? It is your boy. Kiwi, back with another video. I'm going to be telling you how to farm sturdy mechanical parts in Plankerton and Canny crazy fast. Now, this is going to be some simple tips and steps on getting some easy sturdy and easy malachite. So, but mostly sturdy, though. Uh, easy sturdy and malachite really fast in your Plankerton and Canny missions. Now, if you're in Plankerton, you're going to have to be in, like, high-level Plankerton... Uh, I don't know what power level you're going to have to be, but just high level ones, like halfway done with Plankerton already. But um, anyways, guys, I'm just going to uh, just stop talking right now, and I'm going to get right into the video. Hopefully, you guys enjoy. First up that I'm going to be telling you guys about is how to farm sturdy in Plankerton. So let's get right into this. All right, guys, so the main parts that you're going to be looking for in missions is going to be parking meters, these green boxes that um uh, that are yeah like power boxes I guess and obviously cars trucks uh, other parts like that and a bunch of other parts that I do not know the names of but here you go. I'm gonna just show them like this. So that's that's about it. That's about it. So. Yeah, that's, that's basically what you're going to be mainly looking for. And what I love to use in all my missions are is Shock Specialist AC because it has that, um, no, not Shock Specialist, but just any AC thing or any Outlander at all because they have the anti-material charge. If you don't know what that is, it's that one move where you, uh, like, you punch, like, you have that fist thing and you punch and it gains all the materials from one thing object or something and that's basically the main thing that you're going to be wanting to use now if you use ninja or a constructor or anything like that it's fine too but um i think an outlander is the best choice for this all right anyways guys you guys next up is trying to find malachite in plankerton missions same thing just just like sturdy but it's a little different because malachite is way more rare to find and uh since this is an ore and not a mechanical part it's only found in caves uh you can also find it in llamas you can find it in mimics you can find it in storm chests and that's that's basically <laughs> that's basically about it because um that's all that's the only thing you can find malachite in i would actually recommend to use ninja for this because a lot of the times when you're trying to find malachite it's um you're gonna have to fight for it or just mine it normally so i would just get ninja for this or if not just use whatever you want so you're just gonna be doing storm chests and you're gonna always have to fully complete the storm chest to have to get malachite from that and if you don't get malachite that's really rare but you should you should usually get malachite from a fully done storm chest also, um, you can also get them from toolboxes, really rare, but still, you can get it from toolboxes, and yeah, you can also get it from Mimics, and that's, bas that's basically about it for the Malachite, yeah, so that's, that's about it. So the next one is finding sturdy mechanical parts in Canny Valley. Now, this is very easy, since Canny Valley, it's very, it's very common to find stu um, sturdy mechanical parts, but I'm going to be walking you through... Just how to get sturdy mechanical parts in Candy Valley. Basically, like the easiest way of getting uh, sturdy in Candy Valley is just breaking normal cars. It's basically it's it's a guaranteed. It's just a guaranteed um, sturdy mechanical parts. If you get simple mechanical parts from a car in Candy, that's <laughs> you gotta have some terrible luck for that because that's that's super super rare. But anyways, guys, I would really recommend to get uh, an Outlander with material charge. That's what I do. I would just go into a mission, uh, like destroy the encampments or survivors or whatever, 
go into a mission, farm the entire mission, just break a bunch of cars and stuff, get a bunch of sturdy mechanical parts, just leave the mission, and just rinse and repeat, just do the exact same thing in other missions, just do the exact same thing, and it's, um, before you know it, you're going to have, like, stacks of mechanical parts, so you would just do that, and boom, and that's about it, yep, that's about it. So the final thing I'm going to be telling you how to do in this video is how to get Malachite in Canny Valley. This is incredibly easy since um, in Plankerton missions, there's usually just one Malachite. There's always just one Malachite ore in Power 32 and above missions of Plankerton. But in Canny, there is often two to three ores, right? So um, I would get a I would get an Outlander for this because an Outlander has a power where if it keeps it um, well it usually happens but if you keep on hitting an ore there's a bigger chance of you getting two of the same ore instead of just one so yeah I would just use an Outlander for this use your anti material material charge and before you know it, you're gonna be having so much malachite again do the same thing as you did with the sturdy mechanical parts jump from mission to mission do the exact same thing until you have like stacks and stacks of it. And then, boom, you got a bunch of Malachite and Sturdy. So, yeah, that's that's about it. That's the that's your guide in Canny and Plankerton and how to get tons and tons of stacks of Sturdy and Malachite, just like I do. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please smash the subscribe button and click that notification button to stay tuned to future videos. And, yeah, so also, if you enjoyed this video, please click a like. And yeah, subscribe to um subscribe to the channel in the description below. He is amazing. He's very popular and I can't believe he actually commented on my video. But anyways guys, thank you so much for watching. I see you guys in the next video. I don't know when, but I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.